We're at Columbus Flea Market today. Hopefully uh, we find some deals. It is a Thursday morning, so never know what's gonna be out there. All right, see you guys at the first stop. What do you get on the old tins? Baby bottom. Uh, probably about ten. Yeah, you don't see that one too often. No. All right. Thank you. Well, no, said she'd do eight, so I, I think I'll take that. There you go. Thank you very much. Pretty fun. Yeah. Two dollar table. Like the little copper cat. These are all cute. Beaded moon. Hummingbird's good. Shame that's uh, have to get into soldering. Sword's kind of fun. That's believe it or not, that's a Enamel and frogs. Is what is this section right here? Okay. Thank you. That leaf is kind of fun. Yeah, the gambling boat's kind of fun. Alright, see what else we find. What do you get on the... I guess it's petrified wood, right? That is. This petrified, lots of petrified in there. Nice big piece. Yep. What do you get on that? 40 bucks for the whole thing. Where is this from, do you know? Where did it come from? Yeah, like uh, what it, do you know where? No, I don't know where it came from. But there's all kinds of goofy, crazy things in here. Yeah, it seems like it. Yeah, it's a kind of an interesting piece. for all the vowels. And uh, that's what I need. It's a cool piece of cut glass. It's a shame this... I think I can fix it onto something. Those look like they're silver. I don't think they are. But that pin's pretty cool. How much for my jewelries? 
This one doesn't have a back. Mm. You're too good to me. Thank you. <laughs> it's Joan Rivers. That's actually an old pin. Pretty cool with the dragon. This one's sterling and turquoise. <laughs> Go see what he wants on those. Kind of like the key fob too. Oh, he's saying 15 inch. Can you do 40? Yes, I did. So I think I'll, uh, I'll take those for 40. Let's see what he wants on, on that. Plastic, but it's fun looking. All right. This looks like a Wyatt. I got a bunch of pins. I don't know. Definitely see a lot of this is made by Monet. A lot of the same, but every once in a while you'll find something that's different. Made well. I'm missing a stone, but it's nice. Alright, so I got all of these from over that side and these four from this side. Five. So. Give me that 15. Thank you very much. This cable snip's pretty nice. Use this for cutting uh, copper too. Yeah. How much did you say? Five. Five? Oh, uh, what's yeah. up, man? Hey, how you doing? I didn't recognize you. Well, 
I'll have to take that for five bucks. All right. Let's see if there's anything else. I guess that's. Yeah, first time we've been down here since the lockdown. Well, I've been at Collingswood since they opened on the week on the weekends, but this is the first time I've ventured down has, here. Has Collingswood been pretty good? Collingswood, yeah, Collingswood. Been on the weekend, it's good. Great. Yeah, and I I go on Friday, but. I mean, we're getting an influx of, of Route 70 people. There you go. Thank and, you. Uh, it's get, actually getting difficult to get tables. I could believe that. But, well, um, that, you know, wa watching Scrap Farm. And you, I could see that Sundays here has been killer, but Thursdays going slow, huh? Well, yeah. Selling-wise, so, selling -wise, it seems it. But Sunday, all everybody who sells been happy. Oh, Sunday, I watched. I watched scrap warmers been setting up down here. The place looks like a zoo. Yeah. Well, thank you for the the wire snips. Right. He's got a lot of stuff. Angel slash pixie collector. Kind of looks like it's Vaseline glass. Guess it's I have no clue. <laughs> I see a little nice heavy one. It's gotta be four or five ounces. Oh no, it's on, it's on, uh, I'm sorry, it's on chain. But it, all these beads are screwed. Like for someone, you, you know, someone can't put it in a shop because you'd have to restring the whole thing. Yeah. But still. How much is this? It's five and ten. Ten on the heart? Yeah. That's it. That's it. It's the Vaseline yeah. glass, right? Yeah. It's Con Simon stuff. Yep. It's, it's a healthy, this is a nice. Still on the thing you want to charge fifteen or twenty. Yeah. You know, just because of the beads and the glass and they're just a very different you know, stuff. This is yeah, this is yeah. carnelian. Yeah, I think I might do that. Chintz. It's a sewing box. Or it's a humidor. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. It's a humidor. It's pretty cool. Ray, how much is the box? Oh, I'll give you ten on that. Cool little humidor. Alright, let's see if there's anything else. I just took a chance with that one. Yeah, I did a little work on it. You know, I figured they got to be worth a hundred bucks, and I'll be damned if I can get it. It's amazing. Is this only a dollar? Yeah, it doesn't work. You need to yeah. fluid and flint. It. I think it's butane. Yeah, now it needs a flint. Nice and clean, though. Yeah. I think I'll get that for a buck, though. All right. So we ended up with a lot of jewelry today. Um, this one right here isn't a pin but I think it was going to be turned into one um, but uh, in the pins we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven this one's pretty awesome 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 61 62 63
14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. So, I don't know, it's definitely a lot, a lot of uh, auctions for eBay. This, uh, this is Sterling, and so is the Seahorse. I didn't get any, get any other Sterling. I uh, got the large Joan Rivers Butterfly. This was pretty cool. It's a hand hammered uh, copper necklace. Probably looks very 70s. Um, don't know if it has a, I don't think it has a maker's name. It's just like a little studio piece. Uh, did buy the tin for $8. I was very happy about the uh, wire cutters for uh, five dollars. The pretty sure this holds cigarettes. Looks like they would fit in the humidor, but might be for cigars. This definitely has some age. Uh, the little bell, the 1970s California. Um, uh, I don't know who uh who that is but i'll look it up later uh i thought this had a really fun label with the turtle so both those will sell well at the market i might actually keep this uh heart vaseline glass this would be pretty cool on a black light especially since it's a heart shape but i don't know that was everything we found today it was good morning hopefully you guys enjoyed the video of I'll be out there tomorrow at Collingswood, and hopefully we find something pretty awesome. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't yet, please give somebody a call. Uh, remember to wear a mask when you're out in public, and we'll see everybody later. Be safe. Peace. Yeah, that's probably the best one of the day. 1920s. This etched glass one is pretty cool too though.